Hey, what's up, YouTube? Today we're going to go ahead and break down the A-10 Warthog-style Starship. And I'm going to build this thing up for you guys and present you a build guide for it. This was requested over on the Facebook groups that I put out a build guide for this. So here we go. Give me a couple seconds to just tear this thing down, and I'll be right back with y'all. All right, now that we've got this bad boy broken apart, let's uh, go ahead and snap it together. Before you guys can get started with this, you're going to need to pick up a couple specialty parts. We are using a, a Teo 200 landing bay. We also are using a Deimos Slim Docker. I, I'm not sure if, if these parts are special or not. You might be able to get them from your landing pad with Shipbuilder. Um, otherwise, this will be available from Deimos and this will be available from, from Teo. Besides those parts, we're also using uh, Slayton Aerospace SAL 6830 engine and uh, two Slayton Aerospace 4230, 4220 engines, but it, you're actually going to want to put on 4330s here instead. So those, those you'll need to pick up from New Homestead along with two NG20 landing gear and two NG20 landing gear four. Okay, that's it for specialty parts. Everything else is available at your landing pad with shipbuilder at your outpost. That's where you're going to want to put this thing together. All right, first thing you're going to place down is your shipbed 200 landing bay in the aft position so that the opening is facing the back of your ship. Connected to that, we have a tail companionway one by one in the bottom A variant with no connectors on the side. And our 100 DP slim docker is connected underneath that. Next over is a Teo control station 2x1 bottom B. Connected to that is a Nova Cowling 2L in the BM variant. So if you're not familiar, this is what the Nova Cowling will look like in your guide. And if you just select it and change the variant, it's the top mid, the TM. And then if you flip it, it's the BM, the bottom mid. Okay. So... Put a bottom mid right here, Nova Cowling. And then in front of that, you're going to connect a Hope Tech thruster. All right. After that, you're going to drop down a Deimos hole on top of your uh, landing bay. Grab a Teo companionway one by one mid and attach that next. And then you're going to grab another Teo two by one bottom mid or bottom B rather. And place that here. I'm using two control stations. This gives me my maximum crew in my ship. Next, you're going to want to drop in a Nova Cowling 2L TM. And then in front of that, you're going to place a Nova Cowling 2L TF. And then you're going to drop down another Nova Cowling 2L in the bottom four variant. Attach that to the bottom here. It's going to be red. Flip it twice. Cancel. Then move this piece off and bring in a Deimos cowling in the 4 variant. And now you can move this in, snap it as red, flip it twice, and cancel. Okay. Next, you're going to want to bring in a Deimos bumper port aft. Duplicate it, flip it to the other side. And then bring in a Deimos bumper, attach that, or Deimos belly, attach it to the back as red, flip it twice, and cancel. Now we're going to merge all of these components into this Deimos hole. So you're going to want to duplicate this and put two of them right here, and then copy those. And just, you know, put these somewhere off to the side. Grab your reactor. I'm using a pinch 8Z. We want to drop that down one spot into there. So select the reactor in this bottom hole and duplicate them down. And now it's dropped down one spot. So you can delete the top one and delete this. 
Now we're gonna bring in our fuel. I'm using a 700 HE3 tank. And I'm gonna put that right here. I need to drop this down twice. So we're gonna select the fuel and the Deimos hole and duplicate once. Then select the bottom fuel and the bottom hole and duplicate again. Now we can delete the extras and our fuel's down there. Same thing with the grab drive. Select that grab drive and the bottom hole, duplicate. Select the bottom hole and the bottom grab drive and duplicate. And now you can delete the extra parts. Slap your shield on. I'm using the Vanguard Bulwark Shield. You could use an Assurance SG-1800 if you want. Um, I like to use this shield though. And this one, we only need to drop it down one time so it's sitting on the hole. So select your shield, bottom demos hole, duplicate. And now you can delete the bottom hole, you can delete the extra shield, and you can delete these two demos holes. You should be looking at something like this. All right, next, grab a Tamos, uh, grab a Teo 2x1 Top B. I'm using a captain's quarters. You can use whatever you'd like here. Duplicate that up once. Then grab your uh, cockpit. I'm using a Magellan C2. Place that up on the top and duplicate it one time. It'll drop down. Now you can delete this cockpit. And then grab a, te a Teo cowling, flip it to the four top variant, snap it right here. It's going to be red. Flip it twice. Cancel. And now we want to drop it down. So select the cowling and select your bottom demos hole and duplicate it down. Now you can delete these two and we can delete this extra part here. All righty. Next up, Teo companionway, one by one, top B. Go ahead and just put that right there. And then duplicate a Deimos hole, put it on your belly, and then duplicate that and put it on here. Now we're going to duplicate this inside the grab drive. So select that hole, select this hole, duplicate down. Now we can delete the extras. <clears throat> now that's what you're looking at. So our grab drives and reactors are completely covered with holes. And that takes care of these two parts. Also don't need any of this. And that. Okay. Now, uh, now we get to the fun part. So it's the wings. All right. So for the wings, pretty easy. Slap these into the middle position. And then duplicate it over here. Make sure it's in the middle, not on the bottom or the top. All right, and then grab yourself an extra Deimos hole and attach that to the back, and then duplicate one to the side. Select both of these and copy them, and put them on the other side. Now you can uh, duplicate this part, snap it into place here, flip it twice, cancel. Okay. Same thing on this other side. All right, now I want you to uh, put a Deimos hole on the front here. Put a Deimos hole here. Bring over three of these. Copy them. Copy them over here. You're going to bring in three Stroud Cap C's and put those, attach them to your Deimos holes. Okay? Once they're attached, you can delete the holes. And now we're going to drop these down. So select all six. And select your bottom demos hole and duplicate down. Okay. Now you can delete all these extra parts. And we're looking at that. Okay. 
grab yourself a Nova Cowling. And you're going to flip it so it's upside down and bring it on right there. Then duplicate that and flip it and put it right there. Okay, then duplicate that, flip it, and attach it there. And duplicate, flip, and attach there. And now what I'd like you to do is move this part off and move this part off just temporarily. Okay, what you're going to do is bring in a Deimos Skeg B and attach it right there on the edge. Okay. Bring in a, a skeg A, demo skeg A, and place it in the front. Shoot, you know what? Back up. Undo until you're until these are in the in back on the ship. We don't want to move those yet. So just tap your undo button until you get back to here. Okay? And then from this point, now you can put your skeg on. And then put your skeg A on. Then you're gonna duplicate that and flip it. Put it back here. That's why we want this part here right for the, for now. Okay, so that's that. And now you can bring in a demo spine A. Actually, no, don't do this yet. We want to get this part in, and it won't snap, right? This is a demo spine F. So at this point, now you can take these off. Okay. Put on your spine F. On top of that, put on a spine D4. And on top of this, put on a spine A4. Okay? So now we've got that. And now... You could bring in your NG20 landing gear, your four, and put that right behind the cowling. And then we're going to grab in our other regular NG20 landing gear and put that right behind this one. Okay? And now you could select both the landing gear, select all three skegs, select this spine F, Spine D and Spine A. And we're going to duplicate all of that and attach those right to the end here, like that. Okay? Then you could grab these two landing gear and move them into, into their position there. Okay? Now that you got that, duplicate this part and bring it off and then select it and change the variant to the back. And then duplicate that again. Grab one of them, snap it right here, flip it twice and cancel. And then grab the other one and drop it right here, flip it twice and cancel. All right. And now we just need to uh, get these back into place. So since they don't flip, um, we will have to drop it down. So what we're going to do is uh, grab a Deimos hole and get one into place <clears throat> on the end, on each end. Okay, right there and there. <clears throat> 
the spine. So let's uh, move our spine off real quick. Just briefly move your spine off. Both spines. All right, now that those are in place, we could delete these two. Select your spine or select your cap C's and this bottom Deimos hole and duplicate down. And then delete your extras. And now you could slap in your spine D and your spine A. And same over here. Spine D, spine A. Now you're going to grab a Nova Calling 2 LPF. Attach that to the side here. Duplicate it and change the variant to the PM and attach it there. And then you could select both of these and duplicate them. Bring them over here, select and flip, select and flip, put those into place. And now those are done. Now you could grab a Deimos bumper and connect it to the middle position here as red Flip it twice and cancel, and then duplicate that. Place it on the grid, select it, flip it. Now put it into place as red, and flip it twice and cancel. All right, so that's that. Now you could go ahead and bring out your Slayton Aerospace 4330 engine. Um, I'm not sure why I have these 42s, but we're going to bring out 43s. It's 4330s. Let me grab some paint. Now you're going to want to flip this so that it looks like that. Okay, and then duplicate it and flip it so you got that. Then bring out a Stroud braking engine. And you could just attach it to here and then duplicate it and attach it to here. Okay. Now what we're going to do is we're going to take these two and move them right there. And you can grab these two and put them on the other side. And that's it. Our wings are done, folks. Go ahead and grab, uh, well, weapons. You guys could pick your weapons at the end. So we'll go over that later. All right, next up, we are uh, going to complete the top. I'm going to go ahead and drop in a Demo Spine A4, and then a Demo Spine C4, Demos Cowling 4, and two Demos Holes. To the back of your Demos Holes, go ahead and attach your Slayton Aerospace. 6830 engine, and if you didn't have this unlocked, then you could put on the 5830 engine. And now we need to duplicate two parts into this, so bring up uh, extra Deimos hole right there. Okay, now connect to the top a Nova Bracer. And then you're going to select the bracer and this bottom Deimos hole and duplicate them down. And delete the extras. Now we've got a bracer in here. And now to the top of that, connect uh, Deimos tail A. And then select it and select this bottom hole A and then duplicate down. 
Okay, now you can delete that, that, and that, and then grab this demo spine A and put it right there. All right. Next up, go ahead and grab a Nova thruster array and I connect that to the front here. Then you can just duplicate it and flip it and bring it to the other side. Next up, we're going to bring in some Deimos wings. Connect it right here, just in front of the thruster array. Then duplicate it and change the variant and snap it right there. And then just duplicate and flip these to the other side. Right there. Okay. <clears throat> At this point, we're going to end up having some braking engines covering this part. So uh, decide upon what weapons you're going to use, <clears throat> and you're going to end up hiding one of them here. I'm going to use Disruptor 3340 Alpha Beams, and I could have four of these, so I'm going to put all of them here. So one there, I'm going to duplicate it to, the, get one, to get one on the bottom. And then I'm going to put one over here, and then I'm going to duplicate that and put one to the bottom. That gives me my 12 power on my Disruptor 3340s. And then the next thing I want to do is um, I want to hide a weapon here. So <clears throat> I'm going to bring in a equipment plate and an MKE-9 GALS gun. And I'm going to put that right there. I'm going to duplicate one of these off to the side for a quick second. And then I'm going to put my cowling back in, snap it as red, and flip it twice, cancel. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to put one of these on the bottom here, on the back, right there. And then I'm going to duplicate that to the other side. And that's my three Gauss guns, so I have maximum power on my Gauss guns. And then I'm also going to put on some Devastator 1500 missiles. I'm going to put two of these here, one there, and one there. And then we'll get to the rest in a second. Okay, so from this point... Um, what you can do is grab a Stroud Bracer engine, engine bracer, and connect that to your Nova Bracer. Okay, just go ahead and duplicate that to the other side. And then you're going to grab a Stroud Cap A in the port 4. and a Nova cowling or a Teo cowling and put those like this. Now from here, you're going to drop down a demo spine F and then duplicate it here and then duplicate it here. And then grab yourself a demo spine E and put that right there on top. Actually, don't put this here yet. So here's where I'm going to put my other two Devastator missiles. So I'm going to put these on top. Now what I'm going to do is really quickly build out this other side, duplicate and flip, duplicate, and then I'm going to duplicate all of this, even my weapon. And I'm going to put that there. And now I want to just drop these down onto here. So I'm going to select my equipment plate. And this equipment plate. And then this bottom hole. <clears throat> and I'm going to duplicate down. Okay, now I can delete that hole. Delete this weapon and equipment plate. And delete this weapon and this equipment plate. And now I have four devastators on my ship. 
We'll slap on the spine, the spine ease, duplicate one over here. Okay, now you're gonna duplicate this and flip it here, snap it into place as red, flip it four times and cancel. Duplicate a cowling, snap that into place as red, flip it twice and cancel. And same over here, oops. Duplicate this. Flip it how you need it. Snap it into place as red. Flip it four times and cancel. And then duplicate a tail cowling. Flip it, snap it into place as red. Flip it twice and cancel. And there we go, folks. We are almost there. We're done with the with the drop down glitching now. So it's just three more parts to bring in and we're done. So you're gonna bring in a, uh, a Nova 1050 engine and connect that right behind your devastators and onto the middle um, Deimos cowling or Deimos hole A right there. It's gonna be red, so flip it twice and cancel. Duplicate that and flip it to the other side, flip it twice and cancel. And then now bring in some Teo braking engines, snap them onto the engine, flip it twice and cancel. Now, but at this point, it's not actually connected. So all you need to do is just select it and it will click into place and be green. And now accept that. Okay, so then duplicate that and then flip it, and I'll snap it as red, flip it twice, cancel, select, accept. And now grab yourself a Deimos bumper, put that back here, duplicate it twice and cancel. Okay, duplicate that, flip it, snap it into place, flip it twice, cancel. And there you go, folks. There's the A-10 Warthog. I hope that guide was easy enough for you to follow. If you got any questions on the build, just drop them into the comments and I'll be happy to answer. And uh, got a lot more ship builds coming up. So subscribe if you'd like to get notifications on those. Um, we are going to be doing the Morning Glory. Curtis Builds already has a Tomcat. Um, I have an Apache. We've we've got all kinds of ships in here, folks. We've got a F-22 Raptor, a Blue Angel F-14 or F-16. We've got a Swordfish. We've got a Blackbird. We've got the Tailspin Sea Duck. I mean, we got Scorn Falcon. We've got a Mavis. We've got the Planet Express, a Chimera, a Penguin, a Freestar Eagle. I mean, a little mini fly with everything put into one tiny package. We've got the BNSF SD 40.2 engine. We've got a Harrier AV-8B, Discovery Shuttle, Monta Rosa, Thunderbird 3, Thunderbird 4, Jigsaw, Ripsaw, Sherman Halo Tank. We've got a Mech Warrior. We've got a John Deere combine. I mean, guys, comment what you want me to put the build guide next to, and we'll do it. Hope this helped you guys out. And until the next one, everybody, peace out.